Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Today we will cover physics theory 1777. Question 2, classical mechanics, momentum. Two objects sliding on a frictionless surface as represented above collide and stick together. One object has a mass of 0.5 kg and is moving with a velocity of 2 meter per second in the x direction. Other object has a mass of 1 kg and is moving with a velocity of 1 meter per second in the y direction. How much kinetic energy is converted into heat during the collision? A 1 over 9 joule, B 1 over 6 joule, C half joule, D 3 over 4 joule, E 5 over 6 joule. When the objects stick together, after collision it is inelastic collision. Momentum is conserved in inelastic collision. Kinetic energy is not conserved in inelastic collision. Since momentum is conserved, initial momentum Pi is equal to final momentum Pf. Momentum is equal to mass into velocity. Momentum is a vector quantity. Initial momentum Pi is equal to 0.5 kg into 2 meter per second I hat plus 1 kg into 1 meter per second J hat. I hat and J hat are unit vector. They have a magnitude of 1. I hat is in the x direction and J hat is in the y direction. Mass of 0.5 kg multiplied by velocity of 2 meter per second is equal to 1. Mass of 1 kg multiplied by velocity of 1 meter per second is also equal to 1. Therefore, we get initial momentum is equal to I hat plus J hat. Pi is equal to I hat plus J hat. I hat is a unit vector in the x direction that has a magnitude of 1. J hat is the unit vector in the y direction that has a magnitude of 1. If we do the vector addition, we get the right angle triangle and therefore we can use Pythagoras theorem. Therefore, resultant is equal to mod i square plus mod j square under root. Mod i square is equal to 1, mod j square is equal to 1. Therefore, we get resultant is equal to under root 2. Initial momentum Pi is equal to under root 2. Final momentum Pf is equal to Mf multiplied by Vf where Mf is the final mass and Vf is the final velocity. Since the objects stick together, total mass, final mass is equal to 0.5 kg plus 1 kg that is equal to 1.5 kg. Vf is the final velocity, therefore final momentum is equal to 1.5 kg multiplied by Vf. Vf is the final velocity that we need to calculate. Initial momentum is equal to final momentum that is under root 2 is equal to 1.5 Vf. Vf is equal to under root 2 divided by 1.5. Vf is the final velocity when the objects stick together with a total mass of 1.5 kg. They move with a velocity of Vf in the xy direction that is 45 degree with respect to x axis. Kinetic energy is scalar. In inelastic collision, when objects stick together, it is not conserved. We need to calculate the amount of energy that is converted to heat. Kinetic energy is equal to half multiplied by mass multiplied by velocity square. Initial kinetic energy is equal to half multiplied by mass of 0.5 kg multiplied by velocity of 2 meter per second square plus half multiplied by mass of 1 kg multiplied by velocity of 1 meter per second square. This is equal to 1 plus half that is equal to 3 over 2. Final kinetic energy is equal to half multiplied by final mass multiplied by final velocity square. Final mass is equal to 1.5 kg. Final velocity is equal to under root 2 divided by 1.5 meter per second. Therefore, final kinetic energy is equal to half multiplied by 1.5 multiplied by bracket under root 2 divided by 1.5 bracket low square. Final kinetic energy is equal to 2 over 3. Heat generated by inelastic collision is equal to initial kinetic energy minus final kinetic energy. Initial kinetic energy is 3 over 2. Final kinetic energy is equal to 2 over 3. Therefore, heat generated is equal to 3 over 2 minus 2 over 3 that gives us 5 over 6 joules. Hence, the correct answer is E is equal to 5 over 6 joules. This is a medium level question that appeared on GRE and 41% people got this correct. Thank you for watching. Allah Hafiz.